QuantMD LLC is a Pittsburgh-based imaging analytics company with a global outreach offering software as a service medical image analytics on the cloud. We start with standard medical image data empowered with the ability to quantify morphology, function and flow as seen from that data to enhance diagnostic value as well as provide a means to do what if surgeries in a surgical planning type environment. And finally, bring surgical plans empowered with physics informed diagnostics into the operating room to guide procedures in real time. QuantMD technology for personalized quantitative health assessment starting with medical imaging to improve surgical outcome is the brainchild of a Carnegie Mellon research lab focused at improving healthcare delivery using quantitative medical image data to specifically quantify morphology, mechanics, and hemodynamics or blood flow for the express purpose of determining timely interventions and guiding surgeries to improved outcomes. This research lab is called the MedCave standing for Medical, Diagnostic, and Cardiovascular Engineering Group. The novel aspect of our offering stems from a strategic positioning of our technology at the confluence of physics, high-performance computing, informatics, and radiology. In one example in this particular slide, we see on the bottom left raw medical image data of the heart, namely a cardiac MRI, which is used to extract anatomical structures of interest at one or more points resolving three-dimensionally not only the anatomy, but also how that anatomy changes over time. And what you see in the middle of the screen is a QuantMD analytics, one of many, which simply represents the cumulative sense of what is being expressed by that medical image data in terms of timing of mechanical contraction. We have similar indices for mechanically relevant displacements, strains, timing of mechanical activation or dyssynchrony, and also simulation-based parameters such as blood flow within the ventricle of a heart or within the arteries of a heart, which extend the paradigm of quantitation using physically relevant and validated modeling tools which together qualify simulation. Our business model is software as a service image processing on the cloud. How our system works is that we start with patient-specific information dealt with in a HIPAA-compliant fashion introduced to us by means of a referring physician. The physician, knowing of QuantMD, would be able to register a patient anonymized and therefore refer to QuantMD by means of a certain anonymized number and schedule that particular patient for a scan within his or her hospital or facility or one or more network imaging centers associated with QuantMD. These imaging centers would acquire image data specifically relevant to the condition or pathology being investigated in the patient, and the image data is associated with that anonymized information on the patient in the QuantMD cloud. This image data is then processed by QuantMD by means of a supervised set of algorithms that range the entire cumulative process of image reconstruction doing extract surfaces of relevance, be it a heart, a brain, or a breast in the case of a mammogram. These surfaces are then analyzed for morphological or functional traits or provided as input to a simulation environment to model blood flow and things that are not immediately apparent directly from the medical image data. The results are rendered back into the cloud for the purpose of interpretation by an expert. This expert may interpret image data in the case of a diagnostic situation or interact with that medical image data to deploy a medical device or interact with the patient as he would prior to enduring a procedure except virtually to evaluate surgical options. The virtual surgical plans and the virtual diagnostics are again stored and affiliated with the associated information on that particular patient, which is then rendered back to the referring physician or patient as required, or directly into the operating room to guide a procedure in the case of a surgical situation. To summarize our offering, we, being QuantMD and the backbone of the research lab, namely the MedCave, provide personalized medical image analytics for diagnostics, patient selection for certain procedures, surgical planning, virtual surgery, and interoperative guidance. By starting with non-invasive medical image data, we can facilitate quantitative physics base station screening and use those quantitative targets presented by means of those analytics that we produced for interventional planning virtually. And finally, actually introduce these colored surface models representing a surgical plan into the operative space registered against the patient for real-time guidance on the surgery date. 
Quantitative diagnostic screening and simulation-driven interpretation of medical image data can not only improve outcomes of procedures in adults, but has equal applicability in the pediatric world as well. Let us delve into a specific example of quantitative medical image analytics applied to mammography. Applied to the mammography space, image-guided plastic surgery of the breast could potentially more quantitatively define aesthetic shapes, which are both mechanically feasible in terms of stresses and strains on the skin, and also help define accurate surgical strategy to minimize operative time and maximize the likelihood of successful outcomes by means of virtual surgery. This concept of starting with mammography image data and ending up with surgical strategy is a multi-step process. In this slide, we look at step number one. In the case of mammography, traditionally, telegraphic image data is acquired as orthogonal or mutually perpendicular view planes, the cranial caudal direction and the medial lateral oblique direction. These two view planes do not provide a volumetric sense of the breast, but they are sufficient to provide an outline of the shape of the breast. The QuantMD pipeline is the first to orient these two mutually perpendicular view planes based on their shape and extract an edge outline of the breast using an interactive method which is semi-automated but supervised. Once the external wireframe of the surface breast has been established in the reoriented orthogonal view plane, the empty wireframe can be filled in with a three-dimensional surface representing the surface state of the breast as it was imaged. In this case, it is a slightly compressed form owing to the nature of the image data and the nature of this acquisition in the case of breast mammography. However, this surface rendering provides a good starting point to manipulate the breast surface and perform virtual surgery as it represents effectively the correct volume of the breast since the tissue seems to be an incompressible object. Once the three-dimensional surface of the breast is available, it can be manipulated. This can be done using a QuantMD intuitive cloud-based interactive mesh manipulation tool, which is accessible securely via our in-house cloud service. Essentially what happens is the surface model is loaded into that interactive tool and simply with a few mouse clicks or today by means of a few hand movements provided the end user has a gesture based device, they can manipulate the surface of the mesh, enlarge the breast, cut off a piece of the breast or shape it in any way to fit in one or more operations. The operation can then be quantified into a shape-based color map representing the degree of manipulation of that surface and the direction of which that surface is manipulated with respect to its original state. Finally, mechanically relevant parameters could be examined, including the strain experienced by the surface, which in this case might be correlated to the strain experienced by the tissue of the breast as it is filled with a gel or other surgically implanted medical device for the purpose of examining the efficaciousness of this particular surgical reshaping situation for that particular patient. In summary, we have started with medical image data of a standard nature, similar to the way one does cardiology-related image analytics, but instead come up with a means of reshaping the breast and analyzing the efficaciousness of the reshaped breast in terms of mechanically relevant parameters which represent physics as examined simply by means of shape. In this particular example, no simulation is required except for the virtual surgery itself. Mechanics are completely based on shape, and so image data is interpreted as is.